All right, we came over here to my dad's shop to deliver some parts, and he's bought a new little toy. This is a Cushman, as you can see right there on that big emblem that's in perfect condition. Cushman, and this is a three-wheel scooter. They made all sorts of different bikes and trikes back in the day, and this one is in pretty good shape. I mean, looks to be very complete. This front suspension system is pretty wild. Got these little coil springs. And uh, really what it does is that pulls the spring where typically a spring is under compression. This one is actually just sitting there, but it pulls it kind of like a trampoline spring. It's got a little drum brake on it. Oh, and Carly is riding it. <laughs> Sit down on the seat, test it out. There you go. That's good. Yeah. That's going to work way more easily. Yeah, you, you look right at home on that thing. And then this one's like, yeah. You could uh, sell ice cream out of the back of that thing or something. <laughs> Have a little cooler <laughs> freezer back there. Put a little cooler back there. Yeah, that's good. It's got this little bed. I mean, this thing is in really good shape. It's been yellow, obviously, but it's also been blue at some point in its life but it's really not too bad rusty. It could it could definitely be fixed. It's got this brown, probably rust-oleum that somebody's brushed on there to keep it from rusting. Check out that tailgate, Cushman. Now this is what's really cool. Look right there, Cushman brand tires. The tires, they're not Goodyear, they're not Firestone, they're not US Royal, they're Cushman right there, boom. Four ply, made in the USA. That's really cool. And check out this exhaust pipe. Is that what this is? Is this an, is this an exhaust pipe? It seems awfully loose. And this is a, this is like a heat shield to keep you from touching it. Man, that is cool. Got the little change, just like if you were buying a, a real truck back in the day, it would have a tailgate just like this. Oh, I didn't see the shifter. Look at that. Metal flake handle. Whew, that's custom. There's the motor in there. Let's see what it says. Cushman Husky. It says, focus. Cushman Husky, bore three inch, stroke two and three quarters inch. You got the model number on there. Link, uh, Cushion, Cushman Motor Works, Lincoln, Nebraska. That is really cool that it's all together. Man, I like that. Why is it easier to push the brake? I don't know if that's the brake. That might actually be the clutch. Oh, yeah, I don't know much. I don't know much about these things. This could be the gas pedal. This Possib could be the gas pedal. Possibly. Does it not have a twist? No, it doesn't have a twist. So yeah, that that could be your gas pedal right there. That could be your brake pedal, and that's your clutch. That's the top of it. Yeah. Came with this top that bolts on there. Windshield and a windshield wiper. I guess you, yeah, you just operate the windshield wiper with that little, this little crank thing. Yeah, that's cool. Man, this thing is really neat. I, I don't know much about these things, but I am gonna research it. Look at that, a Stuart Warner gauge for the total number of hours. It's showing 2,525 hours. That is cool, very cool. Well, that's another Another piece to the collection here, another conversation piece. Carly seems to enjoy it a lot. Um, I guess we're gonna see if we can get it running and see what we can do with it. There's another view of those tires. Cushman, genuine Cushman 100. Now they're dry rotted, but the good thing is Coker Tire reproduces these authentically in the right size, just like this right here, 475, 775, four. That's a four inch diameter wheel, it says. 
Oh no, it's four ply, sorry. Four ply. I misread that. So anyways, this is gonna make a good project, um, a I good conversation I, piece. I think I could get in here. Could you get in here? You could absolutely get in there. This. No, I don't see. Yeah. I mean, you can, you can do anything you want. It's sturdy. And then I just sit here and then I go through the hole. Ooh. What's this? Um, I'm not sure what that, what that is. What's not sure. Ground. What's this? Oh, that's sweet. Oh, how sweet that is. Yeah. We could go for a ride on this thing. Yeah. You could ride in the back. I'll be up here riding in the, in the front. Yeah, and, uh, or you could ride me around in it. Yeah. Or we could switch while we're driving down the road. Yeah, just be like, okay, I want to see if we can do that. Switch while we're driving down the road. Get in there. I'm getting in there? Yeah, get in there. Come on. Come on. Gotta hold that. I know. You're filming yourself. Yes, I know. Film me getting in there. There we go. That's better. Okay. Here we go. Okay. Now I'm riding. Hey, there we go. <laughs> there we go. There you go. What happens when I do this? What happens when you do that? I don't know. Maybe that's the choke. Okay, here you go. Let's go. Let's switch. <laughs> Let's switch while we're driving. Here we go. It's in neutral. Go. We're going down a hill ah. in neutral. Go. We made it. Yay. Okay. That's I enough. Did. That's enough playing around. I do like this thing. What is, what's going on here? Did you put your battery there? Woo. Is that how that works? You put your battery on the fender? Huh. I have lots of questions. I don't know much about these things. I'm sure I'll do some research, but feel free to leave me some information in the comments. Uh, you can see back here, it's got a transverse leaf spring. It's got coilover shocks. I mean, this thing is high tech, high tech machine. I know where, what this goes to. Okay. What is it? Does it go up there? Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. All right, that's it for this one. It looks right at home out here in front of the garage. I'm sure it'll be fun to scoot around the block here as soon as we get it running.